design friends and fans. This is Cindy Allen, Editor-in-Chief of Interior Design, and welcome to day one, two, day three of Interior Design Best of Year Awards. Today, we're featuring the much anticipated Best of Projects. Now, whether you're new to Best of Year or you're already part of our global family, welcome. Best of Year is where our industry always comes together to celebrate the best of design's best. It's so exciting. This year more than ever, since we can't be together in person, and you guys know I miss you all so, so much. We at Interior Design knew how important it was to honor your brilliant achievements. And frankly, nothing was gonna stop us. So virtual it is. So we've been going strong these past two weeks during our Best of Design 2020. Here's what's been happening this week. So Monday was Best of Year in the Student category, new this year. Yesterday, the Best of Year products, and it was a wowza. And today, I can't wait for Best of Year projects. Missed it? Eh, don't worry. You can view past programming on interiordesign.net. Before we get going, I'd like to do a shout out to our Best of Year Award sponsors. Thank you, Material Bank. I know, I hear from you designers how Material Bank has made your life so much easier to work from wherever you are and get samples in your hands overnight, right? Thank you, MECO and SWF Contract. And thank you, Tucci. First things first, a heartfelt thanks to my wonderful friends at Turf who created this gorgeous custom backdrop just for me. Can you imagine? And we collaborated all over Zoom, just like you're doing right now. But partnering with them was a joy, seriously. Now, FYI, because I know you're going to ask, this gorgeous wall panel is called Reed. It's a nine millimeter felt material available in like 30 different colors completely modular, custom, and has great acoustic performance. Did you see yesterday's panel for best of year product? Yep, there was a lot of construction going on around here, but they made it easy. I mean, come on, you can't get better than this. Great partner, thank you, Turf. And finally, a huge set of gratitude and thanks to our best of year sponsor, Claris, who created our winner awards and honorary plaques. Okay, so let's face it. This year would have been so easy to say no awards since there is no in-person event. Plus our bulb awards are costly to make and heavy and bulky to ship and all that. But no, 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 no. We wanted something special for you, especially this year. And Clara said, yes. And I gotta tell you, it was an amazing experience collaborating with them. Okay, so we needed something flat and shippable. So glass was a great answer. Now, I know how you designers like everything custom, so Claris made the panels fun and customizable so you can play around with it. FYI, they use their UV print technology color drop, and there's still our signature light bulb there. Oh, and when it was just about finalized, get, check this out. I asked, well, can we light it up? And without missing a beat, voila, everything is illuminated just for you our design luminaries. Hang on, I wanna show you a prototype. Gorgeous, right? And then it lights up back here. Very special. And now truth be told, we weren't going to have the honoree plaques, but I really wanted to. So I smiled and just asked them and they were like, heck yes. So, and it looks pretty good too. Kind of looks like a winner. Shh, don't tell anybody. Anyway, thank you, Claris. Amazing collaborations and amazing partnership. In a year like 2020, we are so proud of all of you. A whopping 950 project submissions in 65 categories from 516 firms and from 30 countries. This is truly a global event. Now, listen up. These are the new rules of the game. After the awards, be on the lookout for an email from us from Interior Design for details on your award and receiving digital assets. In a normal year, you'd come up on stage, get your bulb, take your pics. This year, when you win, or even as an honoree, post selfies, images of the screen, be creative, 
and use hashtag IDBoyAwards. Tag us at Interior Design Mag, of course. Tag me at the Cindygram, and let's spread the design love. So, even though I'm here and you're there, let's imagine we're all together as in past years. I will now, will you? Okay, let's get going. I hear the crowd roar. Best of year projects, here we come. And the first category is exhibition installation. And our honorees are Aurelian Chen, Dragon Mountain Pavilion in China. Chu and Gooding Architects, Wright Golden Hayes, Oklahoma Contemporary Art Center in Oklahoma. Lab at Rockwell Group and Cohn Pedersen Fox Associates for Journey to Edge, New York. And LSM and Daniel Chadwick, Gravity, Paul Hastings Office in the UK. And our best of year winner for exhibition installation goes to Rockwell, Lab at Rockwell Group and Cohn Pedersen Fox Associates. And our next category is budget. Modern Out West, File Line Headquarters, Salt Lake City, Utah. Modern Shed, the DW in Seattle. Onyxen, Architects, Joys in Shenzhen. Patrick Thompson Design, Bolero Lanes and Lounge in Royal Oak, Michigan. So fun. Vermilion Zoo Design Group, The High Inn Hotel in Shanghai. And our rest of year budget goes to the Modern Shed, the DW. The Dwelling on Wheels, or the DW, is a beautiful self-contained space big enough to call home, yet small enough to take anywhere. Congrats. The next is Education Higher Learning. And our honorees are CO Architects, Health Science Innovation Building, University of Arizona in Tucson. and BBJ, American International University in Kuwait City. SCAD Design Group, Clark Hall Sheds, and number nine, Savannah College of Art and Design. Woods Baggett, Sunshine Skills Hub, Victoria University in Melbourne, Australia. And our best of year education higher learning goes to Woods Baggett. By offering future-oriented vocational training, this new facility addresses the area's above 18% youth unemployment rate. Thank you for that. Next, education primary and high school. And our honorees are Ewing Cole Mass 2 Community Charter School in Philly. Mithin Blakely Elementary School in Bainbridge Island. Perkins and Will Lyle Elementary School in Lyle, Illinois. Wheeler Kearns Architects Bernard Zell Ansch Emmett Day School in Chicago. And our best of year education primary and high school goes to Perkins and Will Lyle Elementary School. With 26 species of trees and six species of shrubs, the school celebrates learning and the surrounding landscape. Nice one. And our next category is Kids Zone. And here are our honorees. We've got 
Cao Pu, Big Toy Kit Photography Studio in Beijing. Koning Eisenberg Architecture for the Museum Lab in Pittsburgh. Olsen Kudding Anoha, the Children's World of the Jewish Museum in Berlin, Germany. X Plus Living, Mondodo Kids Town in China. And best of your kids zone goes to Olsen Kundig for Anoha. Now, this powerful installation draws from hundreds of ancient flood stories to help visitors understand issues related to contemporary climate change. Love it. Greater World Environmental Impact is our next category. And our honorees are CL3 Architects Limited, the Quay Sai in Hong Kong. Evolved Living by Andrea Cantelberg, the Wellington in Toronto. Minark, Mildred Residence in Venice, California. Shed Architecture and Design, Mi Kwa Mooks Net Zero in Seattle. And our best of year in greater world environmental impact goes to CL3 Architects Limited. This is a mixed use development promoting a healthy working environment in a green oasis amidst the industrial neighborhood in Hong Kong. Love it. Next category, Greater Good Social Impact. And our honorees are Ewan Cole, Jill and Alan B. Miller Tower, Philly. Gensler Plywood Place in Atlanta, Georgia. Perkins & Will, Northtown Affordable Apartments and Public Library in Chicago, Illinois. Rockwell Group for Dine Out, New York. And best of year, greater good social impact goes to Perkins & Will, Northtown Affordable Apartments and Public Library. Check this out, a new urban typology co-locating affordable senior housing with a community library to encourage lifelong learning, collaboration, and community. Greater Good Design Unity is our next category and is new this year. Our honorees are Design Museum Everywhere. We design, people, practice, progress. Lair Architects LA, the Algin Sutton Pool in Los Angeles. I love a good pool. Smith Group, Society's Cage in Washington, DC. The Urban Conga, Shifting Totems in Cleveland, Ohio. And the best of year, greater good for design unity goes to the Smith Group for Society's Cage, helping visitors understand the murders of George Floyd and Breonna Taylor are not anomalies, but rather the latest examples in a historic pattern of systemic racism in the United States. Our next category, outdoor space. And our honorees are Cohen Pedersen Fox for Edge. We have Rockwell Group for Budokan in New York. Schiller Projects Timber Pavilion in the UK. Gorgeous. Sordo Manolino Arquitectos Espacio Arte Abierto in Mexico City. And our rest of your outdoor space goes to Cone Pedersen Fox Associates for Edge. Now, fun fact, this is the highest outdoor observation deck in the Western 
hemisphere. Scary. Are you taking selfies? Are you posting on Instagram? Are you posting on social? Hashtag ID Boy Awards. Don't forget, tag Interior Design Mag, tag at the Cindy Graham, celebrate design all over the world. Our next category is Large Museum Art Gallery. And our honorees are Atelier Alter Architects, the Ying Liang Stone Natural History Museum in China. Big Architects, Musée Atelier Ademar Piquet in Switzerland. Such a ruddy architecture and Roman and Williams for Photographiska in New York. Rand Elliott Architects, Oklahoma Contemporary Art Center, Oklahoma City, Oklahoma. And best of year large museum art gallery goes to Big Architects, inspired by the convergence of the form and the content within a clock. Our next category is Museum Art Gallery, and our honorees are Architecture Research Office for the Rothko Chapel Campus in Houston. Kun Design for Utter Space in Beijing. Jingu Phoenix Space Planning Organization, the Private Fish Ma Museum in China. And we've got Nomura Co. Eisen AW Museum in Japan. And Yao Xiaobing Space Design Studio, The Lake Art in China. And the best of year small museum art gallery goes to ARO for the Rothko Chapel Campus. The expansion of the Rothko campus strengthens the chapel's mission of social action for future generations. Love it. Next, we have Government Institutional, and our honorees are Adeline Darling Design for Geneva Car Barn and Powerhouse in San Fran. We have Amenta Emma, 165 Capitol Avenue in Hartford, Connecticut. Smart Ball Architects Service Center of the Vienna Public Services in Vienna. So chic. Yang Bangshen and Associates Group for Xi'an Silk Road International Conference Center in China. And our best of year for government institutional goes to Yang Bangshan and Associates Group. This is big, the largest and the fullest functional convention hall in China. And our next category is transportation. And our honorees are EXP and Nick Cave Art, CTA Garfield Gateway Elevated Station in Chicago. Gotta get somewhere. Grand Baba Architects Alaska Airlines Flagship Lounge in Seattle. Office of McFarland Bigger Architects and Designers and Czech Witch Pyron Architects. Nana Emo Airport in Canada. Box Architects for the Garin Airport VIP Lounge in Russia. And our best of year transportation goes to, drum roll please, Box Architects. Named after Yuri Gagarin, the first man who flew into space, the architects took the theme of the cosmos for the VIP Lounge. Next we have entertainment. Marvel Architects Theater Squared in Fayetteville. Olsen Kundig Century Project Space Needle in Seattle. Wowza! 
Oh my. Pulse on partnership Bona Palace Cinema Landmark Riverside Park in China. Pulse on partnership SFC Shangyang Cinema Lux in China. And the rest of your entertainment goes to Olsen Kundig Century Project Space Needle to new heights, preserving the Space Needle's legacy and looking ahead to the next 50 years. Next, we've got healthcare, and our honorees are HOK and Ballinger, New York Presbyterian Alexandra Cohen Hospital for Women and Newborns in New York. I crave Perkins Eastman and Ennead Architects, the David Koch Center for Cancer Care Memorial Sloan Kettering in New York. Leeway Daly and Vireo, Omaha VA Ambulatory Care Center in Omaha. Perkins and Will, MUSC, Sean Jenkins Children's Hospital and Pearl Torville Women's Pavilion. In Charleston. So fun. And Perkins and Will, the University of Cincinnati Gardner Neuroscience Institute in Cincinnati. And best of year in healthcare goes to I Craig, Perkins Eastman, and Ennead Architects. Innovations at all scales and touch points create a new model for the 21st century cancer care. Thank you. Next, we have health and wellness, and our honorees are BHDM Design Real in New York. Feel your feelings. Jason Design Group Wellum Pediatric in Shanghai. Merge Architects, the Beverly Clinic in Beverly, Massachusetts. Rockwell Group for Aura in New York. And our best of year in health and wellness goes to Merge Architects. The new clinic efficiently fits a fully functioning six chair office into only 2,000 square feet. Next, we have Fitness. And our honorees are Enter Projects Asia, Vikasa Yoga in Bangkok, Thailand. New and Cole Penn Squash Center in Philly. Look at them. Perkins Will Piedmont Wellness Center in Fayetteville, Georgia. And we have Pony Architecture, Fusion Fitness Q-Plex Premium Club in China. Vermilion Zoo Design Group for Body Concept Pilates Studio in Shanghai. And our best of year in fitness, something we all need right now, goes to Enter Projects Asia using 3D technologies with local Thai craftsmanship, bringing nature to an urban context. Can you say, mm. hey guys, don't forget, you're gonna get one of these if you're a winner. And by the way, if you're an honoree, you're gonna get one of these. Not so bad, huh? And our next category is spa. And we've got Denton House Design Studio, Chileno Bay Spa, in Cabo San Lucas. Leaping Creative Forest, the rest in China. Vermilion Zoo Design Group, Green Massage in Shanghai. Verona Carpenter Architects and Kohlberg Architecture for Williamsburg Bathhouse in New York. And our best of year in spa goes to Leaping Creative Forest the Rest. 
Hercules beetle was the chosen icon since it symbolizes healing, energy, and vitality. And our next category is beauty. AD Architecture, Su Yu Beauty Salon, Harbin, China. Balbic Bureau say no mo in Ukraine. Jason Design Group, a surprise hair salon in Shanghai. I'm surprised. <laughs> Studio I in Shiseido Future Solutions LX in Shanghai. And our best of you in beauty goes to Balbic Bureau Say No Law. The concrete broken arch serves as a metaphor for broken stereotypes in the beauty industry. Wow. Our next category is coffee, tea. And we've got MOC Design Office for Hey Tea Pink in Beijing. So pretty. Aura Liberation Coffee House in LA. And we have Tomo Design for Hey Tea Lab in China. Und Design Studio Hey Tea in Fosham, China. And our best of your coffee tea goes to Tomo Design Hey Tea Lab. Okay, a huge shout out to all the Hey Tea Labs who celebrate design in all their locations. Love it. Next category is bar. Avrico Lenins in Bangkok, Thailand. Balbic Bureau Zweg in the Ukraine. So cool. Minas Kosmetis Architects Lacage Noir in Greece. Sordo Madaleno Arquitectos for Odessa in Mexico City, Mexico. And our best of year in bar goes to Sordo Madaleno Arquitectos for Odessa, blurring the lines between architecture and interior design and how structural elements and construction methods can become part of the space contained in walls. Next, we have Lounge. And we have CL3 Architects Nina Bridal Suite, Hong Kong. I-29 and Math Architectin Felix Meritus in Amsterdam. So chic. NC Design and Architecture Garden Pavilion in Hong Kong. Wow. Sassour Architects for Sheju Estate in China. Williamson Williamson, Osler Bluff Ski Club in the Blue Mountains of Canada. And our best of year in lounge goes to Saucer Architects. Integrating with the environment and coexisting with nature is the starting point of the design of the winery. I'll toast to that. Stick around, more, 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 more. Next, casual dining. AAN Architects Yao Yao in Shenzhen. DA Bureau under the sea in St. Petersburg, Russia. Estrell Studio, Tori Tori, Mexico City, Mexico. And NC Design and Architecture, Mr. Ming in Hong Kong. SW Group, King Dao Flowery Cafe in China. And our best of year in casual dining goes to Estra Studio for Tori Tori. Two mammoth hanging structures are an abstraction of a samurai armor breastplate known as Do. 
Hooray for all our best of year winners and honorees. Now, aha, this is normally where you line up and get your award. Are you dancing in your living room? I hope you're toasting the other honorees. How about a virtual toast? We're all in this together. And I know, as I always say, but this year, especially everyone is a winner. Huggies to all. Shall we continue? Next category, counter service. We have Cadena Associados concept design for De Huevos. Love the yellow. Da Bureau City Food, St. Petersburg, Russia. Department of Architecture, the Commons Saladang in Bangkok, Thailand. Carve One Design for Vista, China. Linehouse Base Hall, Hong Kong. And our rest of your counter service goes to Carve One Design for Vista. A fluttering ribbon in the wind. Next is fine dining. And our honorees are GRT Architects Georgie by Curtis Stone, Dallas, Texas. We have Juan Mancou for Blue by Alain Ducasse, Bangkok, Thailand. Car one design. After Rain in China. Mary Yu Design and Research Office, Jean George, three on the Bund in China. Rockwell Group for Peak in New York. And the very best of year in fine dining goes to. Juan Mancou, blue by Alain Ducasse. Blue, <laughs> capturing the spectacular lake landscape of the effervescent Thai capital. Congrats. Next, we have hotel dining. Avrico, Nai Bay in Bangkok, Thailand. EDG Design, the Chinese National in Jakarta, Indonesia. Arts and Labor Design, Maialino Made in Washington, D.C. Rockwell Group for Cathedral in New York. And our rest of year in hotel dining goes to EDG, the Chinese National. Four venues as an ode to four iconic Chinese inventions. Listen to this, the letterpress, the compass, paper, and gunpowder. Wow. Next, we have Domestic Chain Hotel, and our honorees are Abraco, The Canopy by Hilton in Philly. Nice. We have Mark Zeff Virgin Hotel in Nashville, Tennessee. Carson Labor, designed for the Thompson in Washington, D.C. A lot of D.C. action. Rote Studio and Herzog and Demuron, the Conrad in Washington, D.C. <laughs> and our best of your domestic chain hotel goes to Rote Studio and Herzog and Demuron for the Conrad, the hotel as a contemporary rendition of the classic early American town square. Next, we have International Chain Hotel and our honorees are CL3 Architects, Intercontinental Raffles, City in China. Wow. HBA Canopy by Hilton in Cancun. Tony Chi Studio Park Hyatt in Kyoto, Japan. Vermilion Zoo Design Group for Joya Hotel in China. They're all so good. Our best of year international chain hotel goes to 
Tony Chi Studio, a stunning modern mountain house interpretation of the timeless Kyoto culture. Next, we have Boutique Hotel. And our honorees are Panorama Design Group for Me Hotel in Shenzhen, China. Rote Studio C Baldwin Hotel, Houston, Texas. Studio Locomotive Hotel Gan in Thailand. Yang Bengsheng and Associates Group, the Golden Eagle G Hotel in China. Also good. The best of year boutique hotel goes to Panorama Design Group for Me Hotel. A new peaceful urban resort hotel for the business traveler. Next, we have resort. And our honorees are HBA Canopy by Hilton in Cancun, Mexico. Meyer Davis, Mauna Lani in Hawaii. Ruby. NOA Network of Architecture for the Apple Hotel in Italy. Olab Casa Palam in Mallorca, Spain. Oh, and our best of year in resort goes to NOA Network of Architecture. This property includes a wellness area nestled in a modern lush garden. Gorgeous. Next, Hotel Transformation. We've got Deborah Burke Partners for the 21C Museum Hotel in Chicago. We have Lore Group for Riggs in Washington, DC. LYCS Architecture, Lanao, Yufengli Homestay in China. Martin Lake Uraga Architecture Office for Loop Homes Palace in Granada. So cute. Nicole Hollis, the Chandler Hotel in Atlanta, Georgia. Stonehill Taylor, Conrad, New York Midtown in New York. And our best of year, Hotel Transformation, ah, in domestic, we have Deborah Burke Partners for the 21C Museum Hotel in Chicago. And international, we have LYCS Architecture for the Homestay. The hotel, listen to this, is located in a century old pawn shop. Fab, huh? Okay, next, small corporate office. Figure three, first goal. Finally, home in Toronto. IA Interior Architects Sterling Bay headquarters in Chicago. How good do these look? Ippolito Flights Group Warwag headquarters in Stuttgart. And best of your small corporate office goes to. The Polito Flights for Warwag Headquarters. The headquarters for this paint company is cool and, well, colorful. Next, medium corporate office. And we have Fogarty Finger Architecture for Rockefeller Group Headquarters, New York, New York. Perkins & Will, EY Wave Space in Charlotte. Seguez and Partners, Pernod Ricard, Global Headquarters in Paris. And our best of your medium corporate office goes to Seguez and Partners for Pernod Ricard. The 900 employees were previously spread out over seven different sites and now commune happily in their new home they call the island in reference to the MBS Islands acquired by Paul Ricard in 1958. Kind of cool, right? Okay, our next category is large corporate office. And we have A plus I, 
with the Equinox headquarters in New York. And Moser Associates for Red Star, McAline headquarters in Shanghai. Perkins and Will Guardian Life headquarters in New York. Woods Baggett for BHP in Adelaide, Australia. And best of your large corporate office goes to M. Moser Associates. An interior structure resembling a birdcage symbolizes the spirit of home. Next, we have Biotech Medical Office. And our honorees are Arcturus Benson Hill in St. Louis. Gensler, PDI headquarters in Woodcliffe Lake, New Jersey. ACR, Bristol Myers Squibb Modulus M&M in Lawrenceville, New Jersey. ZGF Medical Research Building One, the Lundquist Institute for Biomedical Innovation in LA. And our best of year biotech medical office goes to ZGF for the Lundquist Institute. Now, you gotta hear this. The company has been quietly producing impactful biomedical solutions for over 67 years from the invention of the modern cholesterol test to right now, they're in phase three trials of COVID-19 vaccine. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Next, we have Finance Law Office. And our honorees are Gensler, financial service firm, New York, New York. Gorgeous. We have HYL Architecture and Spectre Group for the law firm. Shop Architects and K and Co Law Office in Washington DC. Studios Architecture for Hogan Levels in New York. And our best of year financial law office goes to Shop Architects and K and Co in a bold stroke shop inserted an eight story diagonal atrium into the office which they dug the sleeve. Don't you love these fun facts? Okay, next we have Tech Office. And our honorees are Gensler, TikTok headquarters in LA. We've got Unbot, Prisms, Design, and Super Nico Architects for Unbot in Shanghai. WIT Design and Research for FinTech in Beijing. WRNS Studio Soho Office in New York. And our best of year in tech goes to Prism Design and Super Nico Architects. Now, fun fact, the design concept is based on mitochondria and chloroplasts that can be found in the shape and colors used throughout the office. Next, Creative Office. And our honorees are Collective Office, Hall Star Beauty in Darien, Illinois. Gensler, Motion Picture Association in Washington, DC. DC is in the house today. We've got HOK Shiseido America's headquarters in New York. Jeffrey Beers International for Rock Nation, New York. Go, Jeffrey. And Rap Studio for Goop Headquarters in LA. And our best of year creative office goes to HOK for Shiseido. Now, representations of beauty can be found everywhere from the rounded and curved forms and color schemes inspired by makeup palettes. Next, we have co-working space. And our honorees are design agency, Noya House Bradbury in LA.
Matrix Design, Shimao, MWorks, Mao Space in China. Studio BV, The Coven, St. Paul, Minnesota. And Studio Perspective, Base 4, Work in the Czech Republic. We are global. And best of your goes to Matrix Design. The design was used as an open plan layout to maximize the sense of space, light, and flow. Next, we have Firm's own office in North America. We have Double Dam Architecture and Design in Toronto, Canada. We have HLW in New York. We have LeMay in Toronto, Canada. And Perkins and Will in Austin, Texas. We are so proud. And our best of year firm zone in North America goes to Double Dam Architecture and Design in Canada. Now this is century-old mixed-use building that now houses a design studio, co-working space, marketing agency, and an indie coffee shop. Our next category is Firm Zone International. And we have Kun Panda in China. Look at that head. <laughs> Esra Studio, Mexico City. EVD in Shanghai, China. Near in Hue Design and Research Office in Shanghai. Republic Metropolis Architecture in China. Unbelievable, right? And best of year firm's own international goes to EVD in Shanghai. Now, utilizing classical architectural elements with modern approaches, they added a sense of eternity in this little space, and we loved it. Next is Office Transformation, and our honorees are DL Group Stoffelback, Eagle Family Executive Offices in Dallas, Texas, Provincher Roy Government Office in Montreal. Rap Studio for Unity in Copenhagen. Rumu Canada Goose in Shanghai. And best of year office transformation goes to, they're all so good, but it goes to Rumu. Canada Goose, listen to this, built during 1920 to 1930 and used as practice rooms for the former Shanghai People's Acrobatic Troupe. I am literally flipping over this one. Our next category is Corporate Cafeteria. And we have Ippolito Flights Group, La Visione, Object Carpet Campus in Germany. Substance, The Rambler, Goodman Interlink Headquarters in Hong Kong. Yu Kuang and Partners, Wan Shijuan Bay in China. And the best of year corporate cafeteria goes to, I'm getting hungry, Ippolito Flights Group. Not only is it an Italian restaurant, but a co-working space, tea meeting place, and a bar. A big congratulations to everyone. Big virtual hug, big virtual toast, all of our winners, all of our honorees. Now, it takes a village to put on these events in person or virtual. And I wanna send my heartfelt thanks to my team at Interior Design. Helene Oberman, my managing director, my right hand, I couldn't do it without you. The hardest working art department ever, editorial, digital, marketing, sales, and our super video team. Love you all. Thank you. It's not over yet. Let's keep going.
and our next category is commercial lobby and amenity space. And our honorees are CNC Design Co. Times Property Center in China. Charlie Green Studio 600 West Chicago in Chicago. Looks like jewelry, I love it. Gensler, one in Bancadero Center in San Fran. Gensler at the post office in Chicago. Carve one design, fluorescence in China. Wow. Woods Baggett, 347 Kent Street in Sydney, Australia. Our friends, at Woods Baggett. And our best of year commercial lobby and amenity space domestically goes to Gensler One and Barcadero Center. Now listen to this, 250 individually cast ribbons stand one inch apart from each other, creating a transparent layer to view the original fluted concrete core of the brutalist 1968 building, amazing. And our best of year commercial lobby and amenity space international goes to Carve One Design for fluorescence. The whole space is shaped like a blooming flower. Next, we have building facade. And our honorees are Chioco Design for Torchy's Tacos in Odessa, Texas. Oh, yes. We have Corgan, American Airlines Federal Credit Union Headquarters in Fort Worth, Texas. OmniPlan, Dallas Holocaust and Human Rights Museum in Dallas, Texas. OV Architecti Las Vite Headquarters in the Czech Republic. SOM 1550 in San Fran. And our best of year building facade domestic goes to OmniPlan Dallas Holocaust and Human Rights Museum. Copper represented perseverance and weathering the storm to those who have had to endure so much more than we could ever imagine. And Best of Year Building Facade International goes to OB Architecti for the Las Vegas Headquarters. By transforming existing homes from the 1790s and incorporating glass based on the traditional craft, Las Vegas honors its company ethos of uniting modern design and cutting edge technology. And we love it. Come on, I want to hear you. A big congrats. Next, we have residential lobby and amenity space. And our honorees are Marmel Radziner and SOM for 1550 San Fran. MYP Design, Dongguan by Shu Soho in China. We have the Rockwell Group for the Borderline Club in New York. Shenzhen Supernormal Design Company and Kumark Decoration for the Everbon in China. Best of Year Residential Lobby and Amenity Space goes to Rockwell Group. The mission was simple yet bold, to create the most innovative, comprehensive, and cohesive luxury residential amenity experience in New York City. I think they did it. And our next category is multi-unit housing. And we have Double Dam Architecture and Design and Quadrangle Bada Shoe Factory in Canada. Our friends in Canada. Lorcan O'Herlihy Architects for John R. 2660 in Detroit. Studio Arthur Casas Icaro Building in Brazil. Workshop APD, the Hawthorne Park Development in Nantucket. And a 
of Estevere multi-unit housing goes to Studio Arthur Casas. Based on neuroarchitecture principles, the project considers how an environment can communicate with our emotional perception. Next, we have apartment. And our honorees are Axelrod Design White Screens Apartment in Tel Aviv. Gilan Vinyas for the Soho Loft in New York. NC Design and Architecture for Imperfect Residence in Hong Kong. Shelton Mandel and Marp. Pilero Pollock Architects for the Hudson River Residence in New York. They're also good. Space Edge Design, Alex in Singapore. And best of year an apartment goes to NC Design and Architecture. This is a transformation of a 157 square meter apartment in the heart of Hong Kong, inspired by a sculpture garden that pays homage to the ancient Japanese philosophy of wabi-sabi. Next, we have City House, and our honorees are Alder Studio Architecture, Pemberton Residence in Austin, Texas. David Jamison Architect for the Manifold House in Arlington, Virginia. and Talba Architects for the Vertical Courtyard House in LA. Standard Architecture Forest Knoll Residence in LA. Workshop APD, Brooklyn Townhouse in New York. And the best of year city house goes to David Jameson for the Manifold House. Check this out. Inspired by the client's passion for rebuilding vintage Italian scooters, manifold houses and old to the precision of manufactured assemblages. Next category, beach house. Anonymous for Casacova in Puerto Escondido, Mexico. Commune Design and Feldman Architecture for Surf House in Santa Cruz. Shelton Mandel, Curtain Wall 2, Sag Harbor. Stephen Harris Architects and Reese Roberts and Partners for Oceanfront Residence in Quag. They're all glorious. Workshop APD Hamptons Modern in Sagaponic. And our best of year for Beach House goes to Comedy Design and Feldman Architecture. Storyline, a professor who surfs and an interior is filled with commissions from artists, artisans, and designers. Beautiful. Next, we have Country House. And our honorees are Adlin Darling Design for High Desert Retreat in Palm Desert, California. at Alloy Development and RR Interiors for Hudson Valley residents in Cold Spring, New York. Desai Chai Architecture for the Ledge House in Cornwall, Connecticut. Sarah Story Design for Private Residents in Greenwich, Connecticut. And Workshop APD Ski Retreat in Williamstown. And the best of year desert house goes to Adling Darling for the high desert retreat. The client brief, create a modest home that didn't remove a single pinion tree, check. Embrace the rustic desert climate, check. And frame the always changing chameleon-like vistas from within, check, check, check. Amazing. And best of year ski retreat goes to Workshop APD, 
for the ski retreat. With an indoor basketball court and a golf simulator, the indoor area is meant to keep the family's three youngsters active even throughout the winter. Very smart. Next category, residential transformation. And we have Andrew Franz Architect for the Fire Island House in Fire Island. Arnold Werner Architecten and Architecten Schindhelm Moser for the Villa Bogenhausen in Munich, Germany. So she. Drew Mandel Architects for the Breckendale Hill Residence in Toronto. Jessica Helgerson Interior Design for the Albemarle Terrace in Portland, Oregon. And our best of year residential transformation goes to Drew Vandell Architects. Situated in one of Toronto's earliest garden suburbs, this designated heritage residence from 1924 has been restored with two modern additions. Next up, kitchen and bath. And we have Alter Studio Architecture for Stratford residents in Austin. Sand Studio Skyline Drive residence in LA. Smart Vault Architects for the Private Spa in Austria. The Brooklyn Home Company, Brooklyn Heights, Brownstone in New York. West Chin Architects for the Private Residence in Montauk. Hey West. And best of your kitchen and bath goes to Smart Vault Architects for the Private Spa a private wellness temple complex for the 21st century, indeed. Next up, residential landscape. And we have Christos Pavlo Architecture for the Garden House in Cyprus. Federico Del Rosso Architects for Teca House in Italy. Janice Parker Landscape Architects and Jones Brin Margotos Partners for the Jardin Vert in Greenwich, Connecticut. And our best of year landscape and residential goes to Janice Parker Landscape Architects and Jones Brin Margotos Partners for the Green Garden. A residential landscape of 5.9 acres and an equestrian facility encompassing 10.18 acres to be exact. Next, residential sales center model apartment. Now, this was unprecedented. Almost 70 submissions. We have never had that many in any category ever. And the level of submissions was unbelievable. So this is what we did, unprecedented. These are six of the very best, and they all are getting a best of year award. So, best of year in residential sales center model apartment, we have CNC Design Co. for Light of Times in China. This project selected five industrial factory sites to preserve and renew, making the design a connection between history and the future. And our next winner, Ippolito Flights Group, CIFI Sales Center in China. The sales center is close to the fifth largest freshwater lake in the country. So the overall motif is, well, water. <laughs> our next winner, Matrix Design, Polytime Sales Center in China. Various artworks related to the theme of wood and trees are placed throughout the sales center, offering the visitor a sense of walking through the forest, indeed. And our next winner, Mind Design, Sunup Jingquan Heart Valley in China. Built along a mountain and facing water, the building's facade was designed in accordance with the rule of nature and the essence of Eastern aesthetics. Nairing Hu Design and Research Office 
for Yangshan Cultural Center in Beijing. The building quietly rises out of the water as a brick mass with carved out spaces for programs interlocked with gardens that blur the boundary between inside and outside. And Pony Architecture, Poly Galaxy Land K3 in China. The meteorite art installation up on the ceiling has become the focal point and a big wowza. Congratulations to all the sales centers. Big hugs. Okay, next category, domestic showroom. And we have BLDGS, Steelcase, Work Life in DC. Gensler and De La Garza Architecture for Space Store in New York. Huntsman Architectural Group Tarket Atelier in New York. Mario Matzer Architects and Snyder USA for the Snyder USA flagship in New York. Urban Foundry Architecture and Michael Sue Office of Architecture for the Ketra headquarters in Austin, Texas. And best of your domestic showroom goes to the LDGS Steelcase Work Life. The approach was to develop a series of thresholds between two types of program experiences, that of a showroom and hospitality amenities. Next, International Showroom, Trade Show Booth. Oh boy. And we have CNC Design, Sign Tone Marble, 2019 Guangzhou Design Week in China. We have PMT Partners, Verge Casa, 2019 China International Building Decoration Fair in China. Rams Architecture Studio, NIO House in China. V Together Design, J Plus Art Space in China. Woods Baggett Sculpt Form in Australia. Beautiful. And our best of year international showroom trade show booth goes to CNC Design. The carefully constructed path through the trade show booth allows the visitors to experience the feeling of being on a nature walk within a noisy exhibition hall. Next up, large fashion retail. And we have massive design for the Hub Shopping Center in Poland. Peter Marino Architect for Louis Vuitton in the UK. PMT Partners, Jamila in China. Yevin Design, Cone Moding Market in China. And best of your large fashion retail goes to Peter Marino. The combination of art and architecture is meant to make the whole greater and we couldn't agree more. Next up, small fashion retail. AD Architecture, Trongi Boutique in China. Gorgeous. Saisuke Yamamoto, designed for beautiful people in Tokyo. Dan Brun Architecture, RTA in Las Vegas. Mary Hu Design and Research Office, Valextra in Shanghai. MOC Design Office, Bill B in China. And best of your small fashion retail goes to MOC Design Office. Simple materials are celebrated in this pop-up, like oriented strand boards pressed from broken wood and the humble tin foil. And we loved it. Next, we have mixed retail. Moment, a cute edition, Tokyo, Japan. 
Fun Studio, Apple Super Flagship in Guangzhou. Sagesnin Partners, Huai Global Flagship in China. X Plus Living, Zhang Ku Lafayette in China. And our rest of year goes to X Plus Living. The reflection from the mirror ceiling makes this wonderland a surreal sensory experience. Oh boy. Okay, we next we have environmental branding and graphics. And our honorees are Double Dim Architecture and Design and Sally Tabachi for Power 10 Fitness in Toronto. Let's get fit. Elvis Manfredi Architects, 401 Park in Boston. IKD, the Polaroid Project at the intersection of art and technology in Cambridge. Our one design, Dreamland in China. Rams Architecture Studio, Mini Copa in China. And our rest of year environmental branding and graphics goes to Elkis Manfredi Architects. Uniting the building's first three levels is the atrium's custom-designed industrial iron stair railing featuring Boston-centric names and places. Next, marketing and branding collateral. And we have Brand Bureau for Anchovy Social in DC. Session Ready Architecture for Love Letters to New York City. Love that. Studio O plus A for Toolkit for the Times. Simone Deary Design Group for Yours Truly DC, Washington DC. And our best of your marketing and branding collateral goes to Studio O plus A. This is a comprehensive analysis of how work environments must change to meet today's challenges of a pre-vaccine economy and includes both guidelines for office design and protocols to make the workplace safer. Thank you, O plus A. Okay, we're getting towards the end. We have on the boards commercial. Clive Wilkinson Architects and Roshkin Architectos for real estate headquarters in Mexico. We have Cook Fox Architects for Terminal Warehouse in New York. Hariri and Hariri Architecture for Kunming House of Art and Culture in China. Moto Design Shop, Arup Hall, St. Joseph's University in Philly. Beautiful. And SOM 800 Fulton in Chicago, Illinois. And our best of year on the board's commercial goes to by Wilkinson Architects and Roshkin Architectos. The new home for this real estate company was designed to convey the honesty and innovation of the organization, as well as a vision for the future integration and community. Next is on the board's residential, and we have Andrea Steele Architecture and Lasoni, New York, for the Chelsea Townhouse in New York. D Spec Casa Horizonte in Mexico. Do Architecture for Casa Mas in Miami. Ink Architecture and Design for St. Mark's Place in New York. and Masano O'Rourke Senior Housing in Novato, California. And Meyer Davis for Mr. C Residence in Miami. And our rest of your on the board residential goes to Doe Architecture, Casa Mas in Miami. Now listen to this, limited by restrictive development codes and lot limitations, this residence was designed as a collection of raw concrete.
concrete volumes. Fantastic. Okay, you are our shining moment, but this is our last category, shining moment. And our honorees are Shea Studio and Amuniel for shorter than the day in New York. Le Observatoire International and Gary Partners for Dwight D. Eisenhower Memorial in Washington, D.C. One Fine Day Studio and Partners for La Moite in China. Roger Ferris and Partners, 82nd Street Townhouse. Zimmerman Workshop Architecture and Design and Haute Tra for the Entry Staircase in New York. And best of your shining moment goes to Le Observatoire International and Gary Partners for Dwight D. Eisenhower Memorial. The light concept shapes the memorial square as a volume of light, and it is shining. A humongous congratulations to all our winners and honorees. Big virtual hugs and kisses. I hope you're dancing in your living room. Remember, this is a year we will never forget, and you all should celebrate these wins. You are moving design forward, and we love you. Okay, don't forget everybody, tune in tomorrow for day four of Interior Design's Best of Year Awards, where we'll celebrate people. This is the first time. And you'll have the chance to tune in on Friday. Interior Design's gonna do a whole marathon with all four segments, students, products, projects, and people. <gasps> wow. <laughs> See you then. <laughs>